What's up guys, Nate here. All right, I wanted to share with you a little side project I've been working on for the RV. This is, welcome to my kitchen by the way. This is the Max Fan Deluxe. You guys have seen these all over. This is the cheapest model that they make. The reason I like this one is because the cover works as a rain cover. You can open it up and still use it in the rain. Um, now the cheap one has three speeds, maybe four speeds. Um, and that's about it. So there's a keypad control in their stock that gives you like two push buttons on and off and speed and that's it. Then for several hundred dollars more, you can get a remote somewhere with, you know, electric opening, turning the fan direction in or out, um, all that stuff and 10 speeds. So, I kind of thought that was ridiculous and I wanted to make my own. So this is how you hack the cheap mass fan to be smart. So what I've done here is I have replaced the two push buttons. Uh, this is a encoder knob. So this will change the speed up and down of the fan. And then I put a push button on and off here with an LED light. So push it on, light comes on, fan comes on, you can also change the direction of the fan, change it from an intake to an exhaust. And the main reason I did this was because I wanted to automate everything and make it pretty fun. So this is Home Assistant. Let's see if I can get this without glare. So here is my bathroom fan. Sorry, that's a terrible, maybe that's better. Um, it has temperature and humidity sensor. So you can see right now it's 25% humidity and it's 71. You can turn the fan on and off. So here is from my phone, turn the fan on, goes on. You can also change the speed, increase the speed, decrease the speed, turn the fan off and temperature and humidity. So all of that is kind of hidden down in there with some other little circuit boards and stuff. So this is for the bathroom. Um, so it's always gonna exhaust. I didn't really wanna suck air into the bathroom uh, cause that just pushes all the odors all throughout the rest of the camper. Uh, so I wanted to be able to reach up, toggle the fan on and off and change the speed. So I can do that from here. I can also do that from my phone and I can also automate it to do that at a certain temperature or a certain humidity. Um, if it gets too humid from taking a shower, the fan will kick on, exhaust all that hot, wet air. So let me know in the comments if this is something you guys are interested in or if you have any questions. I integrated with Home Assistant. The whole RV will be running off of Home Assistant. I have a tablet. Um, mounted on the wall by the front door where you can control everything, change all the automations. Um, but there's also physical buttons and switches for everything as well as remote control from your phone. So kind of fun, super random, um, but it's something I enjoy doing anyway. So that is how you take the cheap, you know, $180 fan and change it into the $500 fan um, with probably $20 worth of parts and a little bit of time and you make it smart too. So anyway, hope you guys enjoyed and I will catch you next time.